Hi, I'm Kai. This is the fourth episode of my Disney Princess Coloring series. Don't forget to check out my previous coloring videos at the top right hand corner. And now let's see who is our next Disney princess. Tinker Bell. Hmm, okay. She's a fairy and she always has lots of magic powder sparkling around her. That's all make me think of the galaxy. But I have no idea how to draw a galaxy at all. So I start looking for galaxy painting tutorials on YouTube. There are plenty of tutorials there. So I think it will be fun for me to mess around and try some of them out. First is to tape down the paper to prevent red paint. But it is hard for me to tape down my coloring book in this setting. So I hold the paper with my fingers only. Next is to wet the paper. During this process, my paper start wrapping a lot. I know it is because I skipped the first step, so make sure you tape your paper if you were doing it. Another reason is because of the paper quality. Paper is always very important for your art, but for this coloring book, it is made for kids. So, I don't have much expectation on it. It is too thin for that. Hopefully, I can still make it work. Now, let's paint the galaxy. My idea is to make Tinkerbell glowing in the dark galaxy. So I add lots of purples and blue layer to make the galaxy look darker. I also suggest to use some black color while painting the galaxy. Just in this picture, I haven't do that. Why? Because I want to keep the scenes colorful. I don't want the black color desaturate this scene. I'm not sure is this a good reason for not using the black color, but it's worth for me. Now, let's add lots of star to the galaxy. I noticed that most artists use acrylic paint in this step, so I used mine too. I used it in my previous rock painting videos too. It works pretty well. To avoid the white paint drop on Tinkerbell, I covered her with a paper first. I love stars. So I'm gonna to add a lot of star to it.
way too much of a star. Okay, okay, okay. Let let's be calm and use paper towel to lift the paint out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It not looks bad, right? It looks like a semi-transparent spot. Adding clear water on the paint also can help lift the paint up. Pretty nice. Let's keep repeating this process. Then I use the fine tip brush to add more stars. I told you already, I will add lots of stars in this galaxy. Finally, my favorite step while painting the galaxy, which is using the white gel pen, adding some more star on it, or draw some detail on top of the white paint. Yeah, we have a pretty nice looking galaxy. Let's finish this by painting Tinkerbell. The light source is from the top to bottom, so I think her shadow will be somehow look like this.
that she looks great to me. Oh, oh, wait. Part of her body is blended into the background. Let's use the white gel pen to highlight the silhouette of her body. I enjoyed painting this galaxy background a lot. It is relaxing to draw. You can just mess around and let the paints flow. Let the randomness do their job. It will turn out great no matter what you do. Hope you guys enjoy watching it. Smash like, subscribe and leave a comment down below. Tell me are you interested in a galaxy painting tutorial from me? Me, me, me. You know other artists can do it perfectly, but for me, I, I will make a mistake. Yeah, so this tutorial will be just specially for you guys making fun of me. Yeah, so it's gonna to be a um, messy galaxy painting tutorial, I guess. So if you're interested in that, leave a comment down below. Let me know if you want to see me and please hit the subscribe button down below eight more subscriber hit 100 more youtuber here need your support yeah so please hit the subscribe button down below i will have lots of art video and vlogs for you and don't forget to love yourself love your dates and i will see you guys someday bye